In this video, I'm going to show you the best Fortnite gaming settings changes you need to apply right on your PC in order to get better FPS in Fortnite Chapter 5 with your any PC or laptop. So guys, in the very first step, you need to open up the local folder on your PC. So guys, for opening it, press Windows R together from your keyboard and type here percentage, local editor percentage and hit OK. Now press F from your keyboard and this will find out Fortnite game folder. Go for it, open up save, config, Windows client and there you will find out your Fortnite gaming settings.ini file. So right click here go into the properties and guys in the very first step make sure to uncheck the read only box because then you will be able to edit this file then hit apply and click ok now you need to guys right click on your file again and open up this file in the edit mode so guys in the very first step we are going to disable the grass in our fortnite which will help us improving our fps so guys you need to find out here b show grass then guys here you need to choose this value onto the false now go for the next step that is the latency tweak and this is for the input delay so guys simply set it onto the true after that go for latency tweak 2 and set it on the 2 after that guys now you will find out here be ray tracing so guys make sure to turn off the ray tracing on your pc after that now scroll down and go for b 120 fps mode and guys set it onto the full because this will lock your fps on 120 after that scroll down and find b disable mouse acceleration and guys make sure to enable the settings on your pc because this will disable the mouse acceleration on your pc and help you to improving your aim in fortnite after that guys now you need to scroll down find out the next setting that is b allow multi-thread rendering guys make sure to set it onto the enable and guys this settings work best with a multi-core processor and help you to improving your overall pc performance for gaming especially in the fortnite now you need to scroll down and there you will find out your resolution size x and resolution size y and guys you can change it according to your need like if you have a low-end pc so you can use this resolution if you have a Madden pc you can use this resolution and if you have a high and decent pc so guys you can use this native resolution on your pc after that guys now let's go for the next step and in this step guys you need to scroll down and find out here this b is energy saving enable ideal make sure to guys turn off the settings and simply set it on the false now go for b energy saving enable focus loose set it on the false and guys this will stop your pc from saving the power which dramatically improve your fps in fortnite after that guys now scroll down now find out here scalability group now here in the settings in the very first step you will find our resolution quality so guys set it on the 100 percent after that you will find our view distance quality set it on the zero and editing quality set it on the zero shadow quality set it on the zero post process quality set it on the zero texture quality set it on the zero effect quality set it on the zero foolish quality set it on the zero shading quality also set it on the zero and after that here you will find out these three settings also make sure it on the zero basically you need to set all the settings onto the low after that now you need to scroll down and there you will find out the ray tracing now you need to simply guys set the settings onto the full for disabling the ray tracing in your fortnite after that go for performance mode and there you will find out mesh quality guys make sure to set it on the two after applying all the settings in your fortnite game use settings now you need to go for the file option hit save and save all the settings in your fortnite so guys now the next step we are going to configure some important settings in our windows so guys for that open up your windows settings go for gaming tab make sure to turn off the game bar from here after that uncheck this box now you need to go for game mode and make sure to turn on the game mode on your windows 10 or 11 whatever you are using after that here you will find out this graphic settings and guys from here you need to enable the hardware accelerated gpu scheduling because this will reduce latency and improve your overall system performance after that now scroll down and go for the browse option go for the location where you have installed your fortnite that is basically your local dc then program file epic games fortnite fortnite game folder binary 64 and there you will find out your fortnite active file now select out here this file click on the add button after that go for your fortnite hit option now go for this option and set it on the high performance hit save and close out the settings now guys simply launch your fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of your pc i hope so you love this video please make sure to drop a like subscribe to my channel and to let the next video peace out